We're excited that we're on our way to Costa Rica. Uh, this is going to be a really cool expedition. It's a bunch of us got together and now we're going to Quepos, Costa Rica. I have been there before, but I went with the wife and a few family members where I didn't get to fish as much as I'm going to be fishing this time. We're going to have a nice villa right in the jungle and uh, they're going to be picking us up the airport. They're going to take us fishing for five days in a row and then we're going to take a few tours through the jungle to go look at a few different uh, wild animals, wildlife animals out there. It's, uh, I'm super excited and uh, let's see what, uh, we're gonna be documenting all these so that you guys can get to, to see what's the experience in Costa Rica. Beautiful Costa Rica. What's the name of this place? It's called the uh, the Crocodile Bridge. Crocodile Bridge. Yep. There's a bridge right there that we were just looking at. Some huge uh, crocodiles. Yeah, there's a bunch of crocodiles over there. There's one monster one. They said his name is Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. That's <laughs> yeah. what he said. Yeah. And uh, we were feeding him them some mm -hmm. chicken right now. Yeah. Yeah. The locals had some chicken for us to buy and threw it down there and. It was cool watching them eat it all, and this is good. We saw a hawk come down and grab one one of the pieces. Oh yeah, yeah, that was cool. We were hoping that the crocodile would eat the hawk <laughs> in front of us, but it didn't happen. We thought it was bait. Yeah, <laughs> it leave, that's what leave, it looked like. Yeah, leave the chicken there. The bigger, the bigger yeah. bird comes in, and you get the bigger, <laughs> the whole thing, the bigger chicken. <laughs> yes. Now, this is awesome. So what do you think so far? Hmm? What do you think so far? I like Costa Rica. Yeah. It's cool. That's yeah, beautiful. Is this your first time here? No, I've been here before. Okay. Yeah. But I didn't stop here at this place yeah. before. So I think it's cool stopping at the crocodiles, feeding them. That was pretty cool too. Yeah, we drove ourselves and we were just like... So that's a cool thing right now that I, I recommend, at least that we can recommend because of these... Uh, um, the, the, I thought we were going to fly from, from San Jose to Quepos. Right. But it's actually pretty cool that they wouldn't fly so that we can experience, experience yeah. exactly. And that's, that's what Chris... See that, their culture, their, yep. their, the way... Even if they speak Spanish, they, they, it's different. way different than Mexico. Right. Yeah, that was, that was one thing Chris, uh, you know, with Central American Fishing, he said, you know, you guys can fly each way or, you know, drive one time and have the experience yeah. and check everything out. So I'm glad that we did, uh, did, it, did that. I'm glad as well. Yeah. That's awesome. 68,340... I mean, 374, 68,374 colonos. That's $112. <laughs> but it seems like a lot in colonos. <laughs> so we just got to the villa. What's the name of this villa? Villa Perezoso. We just got to Villa, Pere villa Perezoso in Quepos, Costa Rica. Uh, we have an ocean view. It's a flo four floors? Four floors. Uh, five floors. Five, five, floors, five, five floors, floors on this house. It's amazingly way, way bigger than what I was expecting and beautiful. And uh, they were telling us that we should be getting visit by a bunch of monkeys. <laughs> that we should shoot them, tell them to go away because they destroy stuff. <laughs> Stealing cigarettes and cell phones. <laughs> cell phones too? Yeah. Oh crap. Cameras. So we, we, they take cameras too, then. So okay. ten cuidado. Eh? Los congos eh, llegan desde por acá, se comen estos pavos de acá y aquí los, los ves. Ajá. Se llaman congos esos. Lo, aquí hay tres tipos: están los cara blanca, los, ajá, los tití y los congos. Los congos. Lo, el, el congo es el animal en la tierra que produce sonido más, más largo. Cuando, cuando estás en la montaña, a veces hasta 5 kilómetros se escucha la, la, la resonancia y son de ese tamaño. Ajá, pero. Sí, so, y más, sí. más robustones.
This is day number one. Today is day number one. We're fishing. We're going to be fishing for snook. We're catching some sardines, but these sardines are huge compared to the ones we catch in Cabo. Those are the sardines that they're, we're catching on, out here. And compared to what we catch in Cabo San Lucas, these things are huge. It's just, I love it already. I see why people come down here and then end up staying. <laughs> this is cool. Oh, Marvin. Arturo! Arturo! Hook up! That's good, that's good. Oh, they came off. No, 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 no. No, he's there. I'm letting it run. Vámonos. Hook up. Yes. Hook up. Hook up. Yep, let me get out of your way. Yep. I hope it's a freaking Come on, Snook. Wow. So beautiful. Yes. Yep. You got dinner? Yep. Well, not yet, but yes. You know, it's a grandote, that's a huge freaking snapper, too. <laughs> yeah. Good job. So that's yeah. the first big fish of the day. Oh, I was hoping for thing. Snook, but that's I'm happy oh, with this, too. Awesome. <laughs> Okay, so that's a uh, guacamayo snapper. It's actually huge, beautiful. I never caught one of those before. Guacamayos. Tienen dientes grandes como los cubera. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm so excited. We got a fish on board. I mean, we we were only trolling for like five, five minutes. minutes. Yeah, about five minutes, and Arturo got a hook up. So we're definitely in a fishy area. And our our next one, hopefully, will be a snook. 